Good morning. We are here in Valencia on a beautiful day, a bit cloudy, but uh, still really nice. And we're doing another walk and talk, me and Mia. And this time we're going to talk about a bit controversial topic, which is marriage versus uh, having a girlfriend, boyfriend or uh, best friends with benefit type of situation. And I'm going to say what I feel about it and Mia's going to talk about her point of view and maybe other Filipinas point of view and uh, I know it's going to be a bit controversial but uh, this is my opinion and her opinion and I hope you respect that and okay so here we go I'm going to give the camera to Mia and she's going to uh, hold the camera okay so I'll start with me try to hold up sorry about that Let's start with me. My opinion on marriage is basically don't get married and uh, oh, here I'll hold it, it's better. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> so my that. opinion on marriage is uh, um, you know I, I don't believe in marriage and the reason for that is based on my experience of marriage I've been married twice and I've seen how people change because of marriage and I've talked to lots of other people who are married and many of them in the same situation and also after my divorces I started reading more about marriage and statistics and everything and you know uh, one of the reasons another reason I'm completely against marriage is because I don't want the state to get involved. So, when you sign a contract, basically that's what it is. Marriage is a contract that says you're going to be with that person, you know, for the rest of your life. You're getting the state involved because anything to do with that marriage is now sanctioned by the state. Another thing to be aware of is that, for example, in the US, I don't know how it is in Europe, but in the US, 80% of all divorces are initiated by women. And typically, in divorces, I would say the majority of divorces, women are the people who gain and not men. So, those are some of the reasons I'm against marriage. And I just think if you really like somebody, love somebody, you don't have to sign a contract. That person wants to be with you, no matter what, right? Don't worry about the dogs. Me, I'm so scared of dogs. I love puppies, but I don't like big dogs. <laughs> so, yeah, so I just think if you really love somebody, you stay with them. You don't, I don't, like, I don't want to be in a situation where I'm married to someone and this person doesn't want to be with me, but is just with me because of a contract, you know? Mm -hmm. If you want to be with me, stay with me. If you don't want to be with me, don't, you know, just leave. Same with me. If I want to be with a person, I stay. If I don't, I leave. I just, I just think... Oh no, there's an electricity thing, baby. What do you mean? Like, the leaves. Oh. Okay, okay, stop worrying so much. <laughs> 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 so that's my point on marriage now I don't know about Mia she maybe has a different point of view how about you what what what, what do you think about marriage and minuses and pluses and are you for it or are you against it well I am 50 50 50 50 okay. yes I am against it but you're against I'm marriage a, I'm against marriage but I'm in it if you know what I mean no, I don't know what you mean. You have to explain that <laughs> yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just very funny. <laughs> okay. So, like, here in the Philippines, we do have a culture, like, you know, um, before, like, 1980s or, like, the 90s people. Yeah. We do have here, um, we wait. call it here, Harana. Harana, what does it yeah, mean? Yeah, like, men will do, I mean, will sing. A song in front of the girl's house and really yeah that's so romantic and then you oh know, my god this is the end of the trail yeah 
So they'll sing a song like to tell the girl they're interested for, at her? Yep. And wow. Then, and then they will bring um, Harana. Course, flowers and you know before before they get to to hold the hands of the girl, they need to pass the parents of the girl. Like, so there was a lot of courting. Yeah. More much more traditional than is the case today, is that yes, right? Yes, yes. So okay. like I like how the marriage worked before. Yeah. Done right now. So how does it work now? Like right now, <laughs> it's just like you know, you if you wanna like, will you marry me and stuff like that? It's just not as romantic as before. <laughs> okay, well, just tell our viewers, this is a trail. I think it goes many kilometers up in the nature. It's one hour and thirty minutes of walk going to Mount Alinus. One hour and 30 minutes of walking to Mount Alinus. Now, what's in Mount Alinus? It's a mountain, of course. Uh, one of the mountains here. Oh, it's in... like the mountain top? Yeah. Oh, so it takes about 90 minutes walking to get to the mountain top. I will never get there. <laughs> well, one day. So, so, like, I mean, I'm on it. Because, like, I just, I just love the thought, you know, like a guy doing the courting and and you know singing a song in front of your in front of your windows and our doors and all your neighbors are looking at it and it's like so you know you, it's just you, so romantic you, for me basically you love the attention the attention that you got from that um not just a, not just the attention but just the, the guy shows you how much he cares then yeah, right yeah yeah so like but now you say it's not like that why why did that change well, right now they do like <laughs> you know, uh, what's it called? This they just met somewhere, they met online, and and I mean, it, it bas basically changed, yeah. Mo mo more live in partners now, yeah, right? Yeah, so that's become the standard now live in yes. partners, and lots of girls here get pregnant before they get married yeah, right? not like, like before but before it's not like that right it's not like that because so, uh, parents are more strict before like like so when did obviously you're too young but maybe you know but like because you I, I mean you weren't you know grown up in the 80s but what like do you know when this started to change why it changed here I guess 2000s in the 2000s mm -hmm. Was that the influence of the West, or was it the influence of TV, or the what? What I mean, do you know? I basically I don't know, but for my like just for me, I guess it's uh, from you know from TV show and like because I saw a lot on TV before, mm. like you know documentaries about teens getting pregnant. So like, I guess... So you think it was influence from the West then? I guess, yeah. But, I don't know, but that's just for me, okay? I don't... Yeah. Look, babe. Uh, the leaves there, babe. The there. leaves? No, there. Oh yeah, they're touching, so they were sparking earlier, they're right? sparking. No, right now it's also sparking. Where? I don't see it. No, like right there. Oh, right there? Wow. So the leaves are touching uh, a high voltage wire and... I guess about maybe. A banana. <laughs> Get burnt bananas. <laughs> so, um, okay, so that's the past. How about now? I, I mean, you said you're 50 50. Are, are you saying that right now you don't believe in marriage the way it's, it's, it is, or are you saying maybe you get married, but it's not, a, it's not a big deal? What, what, what's, what's your like? I guess I still believe in marriage, but because it's about the union of the two partners you know yeah so like i still believe it but if, for example just for example if we get married yeah i mean it's just okay it's just okay not, yeah. not a big deal like it not was a before big deal. okay so remember when we first met yeah i told you i'm never getting married yes you remember that i know I remember what that. how did that make you feel did you say oh well i don't care or did that make you like oh god damn i no like i was like oh my gosh is he for real <laughs> <laughs> no i was thinking about you were it. shocked yeah because my parents want me to 
marry you. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, you know, I hesitated to tell my mother about it. Yeah. You know, my father is the one who told me, you need to get married, okay? Not like your sister who doesn't get married. Your sisters. Yeah, my sisters, rather. Yeah. And then... So her sisters are single mothers, right? Two they, of them? Uh, no. Two of them are not single mothers because they're back with their husband. Oh, okay. And well, they were married, but then they broke things up. Things get... They moved out of their husbands yeah, or yeah. something like that. It's a big mess. I can't keep up with it. Too many sisters to keep up with what's going on there. I only have three big sisters. <laughs> yeah, but still. You can't just keep up and all with the, the half sisters, <laughs> all the half sisters. I can't keep up with it. I got too much going on. But yeah. Um, I, can't, I can't even remember the birthdays. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. So I. Uh, but then I explained to you why I was a. I didn't believe in marriage. Yeah. And after my explanation, because I didn't want the state to get involved, and if you love someone, you stay with them. If you don't love them, leave. I don't. There's no point going through a divorce and all that stuff. Yeah, yeah. What did you think about that? What did you think about my arguments? Did you think, oh God, that's so bullshit, or did you think he's got a point there, or what? I mean, what, what got, do you have? You got, you got a point in there, because like I was thinking about it. I mean, girls or women, they have the advantage when you guys get married, right? Why, why, why do they have the advantage? What's the advantage? Because if you, if the women get they get married, yeah, and of course you got a baby, and of, she'll just gonna it's, stay it's, at it's home, and, and you, you, the man is the one who's working, yeah, and you know she's just in the house. I mean, if even if you're just in the house, I mean you you'll do the task. It's not hard to be a mother after all. Yeah. So. Actually, for me, marriage is a bit different in the East than in the West. And the reason I say that is because I don't know about divorce courts. I mean, there's no divorce in the Philippines, Only but there's annulments. A, a, annulments, but yeah, but still but it take years, honey. Yeah, to get that. yeah, exactly. But still, my my whole point with marriage in the West, at least, is that typically, I wouldn't say just typically. I mean the majority of cases where a man and a woman are together and there's a divorce it's usually the man who comes out the loser in that divorce mm -hmm. both emotionally and financially, financially. because financially uh, usually the woman gets more of the assets uh -huh. she can get uh, what do you call uh, if you don't have a prenup uh, what do you call that you get uh, alimony you get alimony uh, in some states you get child support if you have children, which is, I mean, you got to support your children, but the child support in the U.S. can be ridiculous, uh, depending on how much money you make. So it's, it's, just, it's just set up for the man to lose. And in, in most cases in the U.S., even though it's changing slightly, the woman gets the, the, the children. Uh, it's not even shared custody, but that's starting to change. But so it's, it's a lose situation for a man. Also, one thing that I, I've, I've also seen is that when people do get married, there are changes in those people because yeah. as long as people feel uh, secure, secure in, in, in a marriage, sometimes their attitude change. I mean, there's, there's a joke that, uh, what is it, how do they say that, like once you get married you gain 10 pounds or 20 pounds or 10 kilos, 20 kilos, you know, and the reason is People don't feel they have to do anything anymore to keep the relationship. Maybe they start, stop going on dates. Maybe they stop creating memories because, you know, they feel secure. Oh, she's mine or he is mine. I don't have to do anything anymore. I, have to do, I don't have to work out. I don't have to, like, I'll just buy some frozen foods in the, in the shop and make dinner. You know, I'm not yeah. going to. But when you're working to keep that relationship, when you're working to keep that person happy, both from the female and the male side, I think the relationship is better. So, I don't know. When, like, for us, we have a wonderful relationship, I feel. Yeah, we do. <laughs> <laughs> That's no joke, okay? That's real. <laughs> and, uh, um, you know, we don't argue much. And I, I don't know if. No, I, sometimes you just start making arguments. I? Yeah. <laughs> Why do you say that? Because you're bored. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's a that's a, that's that's as a joke though. That's not 
that's not like a real argument. That's like me pretending I'm arguing with her, and then she just starts laughing. <laughs> but uh, yeah, but where was I? I lost my train of thought there. Um, yeah, the financial. Oh shit! I lost. What was I talking about again? About like how. Oh shit! I lost. <laughs> <laughs> you lost your thought. <laughs> That's a sign of getting old, people. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not old. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you forgot too. <laughs> not just me. <laughs> no, um, yeah, so, yeah, people stop trying. That's where I was at. I'm not saying this happens in every relationship. Don't get me wrong. I'm just saying on average, and I've seen it many times. I've seen how people, once they get married, they start gaining weight. They stop trying. They, and I just, I don't know if marriage is a healthy thing to me and I, I know many of you my subscribers will disagree and I'm sure for some people marriage is a really good thing I'm just talking about my opinion and how I feel about it since I've been through two divorces and the women I was married to I mean we had our issues but it was nothing wrong in the relationship like per se I mean we weren't arguing every day but still it didn't work out and you know everybody wants to blame the other part but you know partially you have to take the blame yourself because maybe I did that unconsciously I stopped trying the way I would have if I was if I was not married maybe oh. I don't know but anyway we're walking here again and Babe. by the way I'm recording this in uh, 4k to try to compare it to the other recordings I've done in 1080p and if you guys prefer in 4k I don't know how many people actually watch in 4k compared to 1080p if any of you are watching in 4k and prefer it in 4k let me know and then I'll start filming everything in 4k I've been doing everything in 1080p it's easier to uh, to edit and it's easier to upload the files are smaller obviously so So I filmed this once before, but I'm filming it in 4K now. So enjoy the view. Anything else you want to say about the marriage? Mm -hmm. How about friends with benefits? What's your opinion on that? Friends with benefits? Yeah, you have heard of it? Well, one of my friends does that. One of your friends does that? Why? Like, is it just for mm, uh, fun? Fun. Just for fun? Pleasure. Pleasure? Yeah. Yeah. I mean... What? What? This... Can I ask you something? Sure. I don't think I've asked you this question before, so it's kind of on the spot. You know in the beginning, remember when I told you I just want to be friends? Yeah. I didn't say friends with benefits, I said just friends, right? Uh -huh. Remember? What if, like after a while I told you, let's just be friends with benefits? What's your reaction to that? I don't, okay. want, I don't want to have a girlfriend, I told you. If I told you that, I just want to have benefits then and friends. Maybe I'll tell you, even though I had a big crush on you. I'll be like, okay, then if you don't want... Or you will not accept my relationship with you. I mean, just find another girl who, can, who you can fuck. You know? You're not allowed to use that word. <laughs> <laughs> But you said it! <laughs> did I? Yeah, okay. you lost video, you did! <laughs> so we'll have to edit that word out. But, uh, but maybe not. I think, you know, I mean, <laughs> I have a different opinion on this. I think maybe you would have said yes in the hope, because I've, I've noticed that sometimes girls say yes in the hope that, you know, that the guy... Will. Yeah. It was like me and you in the beginning, I said I just want to be friends and then we started hanging out and then we started having feelings for uh, you already had feelings for me but i started I having had. i started having feelings for you and hey, you know you said uh, all. <laughs> <laughs> so you know that's how some relationships actually start like friends with benefits and then then yeah i think so maybe my viewers can comment if that's uh, if they've ever had that happen yeah where they start as friends with benefits and then it goes to uh, something else. Yeah, so that's our talk on marriage and boyfriend, girlfriend, friends with benefits. Uh, we'll just go down to the bottom here. Okay. 
and then go back and then go to the waterfall um, yeah so it's it's a bit of a controversial topic because people have strong opinions on this but just remember These again this is our opinion, opinion. and uh, our opinions are typically formed by uh, our experiences and uh, also by what we read and what when we talk to other people we listen to their experiences and that's my experience that marriage doesn't really work anymore in these in these days generation. Uh, in this generation the way it used to and I think the days of marriage are kind of uh, gonna be limited uh, not limited that's not the right word but it's coming towards there's going to be less and less people getting married, I think, and I, I see it even here in the Philippines. Less and less people are getting married, and uh, I'm done talking here. We're going up, and um, I need to get in better shape. This quarantine has, <laughs> <laughs> has put me way out of shape. So, okay. Quarantine wait. To all my subscribers, thank you for subscribing, and to anyone watching this video, and hasn't subscribed I'd ask you to subscribe that helps me build my YouTube channel and that way I produce more content and please comment below if you like the com uh, content if you think what I'm saying is BS or you like what I'm saying or just have a discussion below about marriage and uh, we'll go from there thanks bye